Hey everyone, so welcome back to another video on our channel and in this video we are going to talk about very big multiple hirings that are coming from IBM and the other hirings are from IMC and finally there is a hiring from Molex. So all of these hirings are very important and there is a very big chance of getting exam mails from this. Especially this IBM associate system engineer hiring is really very important. There is a huge number of students who are going to get exam mail from this. So I'm going to discuss all about these three hirings one by one but before moving on if you are new to our channel make sure to subscribe join our telegram uh, from the description box link and also make sure to click on the bell icon after subscribing because we post different hiring onboarding exam different different industry updates interview updates everything regularly we post so make sure not to miss out also if you are looking for different different jobs in this session market make sure to at least check back to our channel every day once because we post different hirings and you have to apply to all the hirings and every day you have to apply because the hirings uh, might close very soon after posting like within one two days so don't like apply for a hiring i have already posted 10 days ago okay try to apply within the same day or within one day and also we have to make the modifications i recommend in the videos uh, while applying you have to make the uh, modifications in your resume only then your resume can get shortlisted otherwise they will send you rejection mail immediately so let's check the hiring today first we are going to discuss the hiring from molex molex is hiring for graduate engineer trainee job role the location they have mentioned will be bangalore okay let's check this hiring one by one first of all the basic qualifications they're asking for will be be btech in electrical or electronic and communication domain okay you should be a b or btech candidate in these two domains okay other domains are not ap applicable or eligible for this what are the things they are uh, requiring what knowledge so knowledge of eda cad these things okay what will put you ahead so if you have these knowledges they this will help you and this will get your resume shortlisted so you have to add this uh, there are multiple points given you have to add at least few of this in your resume so that your resume can get shortlisted and like this uh, good computer skills microsoft office tools good communication and interpersonal skills written and communication uh, english skills able to work in cross-functional teams okay like CAD uh, knowledge basic electronic circuit knowledge these things next hiring we are going to discuss is coming from IBM and there's a very big opportunity coming from IBM for associate system engineer job role okay this is a very good opportunity and multiple uh, students or many students are going to get revert back or exam mails from this okay if you have recently applied for this same job role then don't apply for this but otherwise you should apply for this okay again listen carefully i'm not saying if you have applied to ibm there are also multiple hirings i have post for ibm earlier like that were for software developer backend developer these type of job roles if you have applied for those job roles you can still apply for this one because this is a separate job role but if you have applied for this particular associate system engineer job role earlier and you are still in the process then do not apply for it if you have all applied earlier and got rejected then also you are fine to apply okay but if you're already one hiring process of a associate system engine if you're already in that then do not apply for this okay if you have rejected or if you have applied for other position then you are fine to apply let's check the requirements for this associate system engineer job role from ibm requirements they have not given in many things they have just given some small things like programming languages like uh, preferably in java python or node.js so uh, if you have any of this that will give you some good advantage in getting a resume shortlisted so at least java python this many people already knows this java and python so you have to add this in your resume okay make sure to specifically mention this in your resume so that your resume can get shortlisted uh, then later don't say in the comments that i'm applying but not getting any uh, reply because we are not making our advancement in the resume or not making the modifications that's why it is not getting shortlisted also this software development life cycle concepts you have to mention this as well like software development life cycle this type of things okay so you have to add these things in your resume these keywords in your resume so that it can get shortlisted also let's see what is the preferred technical professional expertise they have mentioned problem solving and communication these two skills also you have to mention in your resume like problem solving and communication good communication these things okay so that's it this is an entry level job 
and the final hiring we are going to discuss is coming from IMC. This is also a very big opportunity. Okay, there is a good number of students are going to get exam mail for this also if you are uh, making or submitting a relevant resume. That is, so first of all, the hiring is for graduate software engineer job role from IMC. Location is mentioned as Mumbai. What are the skills required? The BTEC uh, in computer science and electrical engineering from Taiwan Engineering Colleges is required. Graduation batch of 2024 is eligible for this. Okay. 2023 is not eligible for this only 2024 batch eligible for this advanced analytical skills and a desire to solve the complicated problems good knowledge of algorithm and data structure proficient in programming languages this java or c++ is preferred and uh, so i have to add this java and c++ in your resume so that your resume can get shortlisted uh, shared interest in financial markets also you should have and these things are needed okay so that's it and the link i will give for all the applications in the description box you can apply from there